Off to Louisville now then for the Santa Anita handicap. Oh, globe trotting today. Uh, this one is a one mile two furlong group one handicap for the older horses, four year olds and upwards. Trapanga Lavella for Darren Thompson at the top. Scottish Warrior, Jim Murray, Filibuster Hare, Martin Lidham, Shimna Camellia, Dan Hughes, Elemental, Padraig Hogan, Cotillion Sailing, Thomas Rogers, Monsoon Sunrise, Paul Rhodes, Humanities Saviour, Leon Van Rensburg, Ultimately Brooke, David Robertson, One Eyed Man for Derek Hinton, Small Vacation, Craig Beckwith, and El Paso Intrigue, Vinnie Gerard, one or two good horses from last season back in this. And they're all installed and ready to go. And the way they go a little bit slow, that was Phil and Buster here. The right over on the far side, Humanity's Saviour was the one who got out quick. There. They've already passed the winning post. They've got a full circuit of the track to do. And ultimately, Brooke the Grey has now come through to challenge for The pace is not hot. And Monsoon Sunrise has now come through to take the lead. So Monsoon Sunrise is the new leader from ultimately Brooke and Humanity is saving them. They're slowly away. Filibuster here has moved through into fourth. Trapanga Lavella is next. Then One-Eyed Man and Scottish Warrior looking towards the back. El Paso intrigue the grey. He's the back mark of the other grey, Shimna Camellia, who's having its seasonal reappearance. But he's ultimately Brooke in the lead from Monsoon Sunrise in second. Then Filibuster here and One-Eyed Man are third and fourth. Humanity is saving on the inside is next. Trapanga Lavella and then Cotillion Sailing from a Scottish Warrior and then Elemental and Shimna Camellia Small Vacation and finally El Paso Entry past the sixth then and Monsoon Sunrise and ultimately Brooke are three lengths clear of the chasing pack we're headed by Philly Buster here Trapanga Lavella is next then One-Eyed Man and Humanity Saber and Cotillion Sailing and then after that Scottish Warrior Elemental's starting to get going El Paso Entry's got a lot to get by at the moment they've got four furlongs still to go and it's Monsoon Sunrise who's in the lead from ultimately Brook in second. Trapanga Lavella is next. Scottish Warrior now coming through with a run. Humanity's Saviour is trying to get going. So too's One-Eyed Man and Philly Buster Hare looks warm pace. The Greys are trying to run on particularly El Paso entry but it's Monsoon Sunrise with two and a half furlongs to go. Monsoon Sunrise is two lengths clear of Humanity's Saviour in second. Scottish Warrior in third then ultimately Brook One-Eyed Man. Trapanga Lavella but it's Monsoon Sunrise, they haven't got two yet, furlong and a half to go, and it's Monsoon Sunrise from Humanity's Saviour, Monsoon Sunrise is not stopping, Scottish Warrior and ultimately Brooke are trying to close, but now he is stopping as they pass the furlong pole, and it's Monsoon Sunrise from Scottish Warrior, Scottish Warrior takes it up, ultimately Brooke, Humanity's Saviour and One-Eyed Man, it's on the nod, it's One-Eyed Man nearest to us, who's beginning to get up, One-Eyed Man from ultimately Brooke, it's close, One-Eyed Man and ultimately Brooke, really close up, well, that finish makes it pretty exciting. No idea where the, what the angle is though because the winning post on the other side but I think the Grey's taking it. Ultimately Brooke or David Robertson. Let's take a look and see. And it's a win for ultimately Brooke and David Robertson and one-eyed man for Derek Hinton was second. Scottish Warrior Jim Murray third. El Paso Intrigue for Vinnie Gerard was fourth and Humanity's Saviour for Leon Van Rensburg was fifth.